You've probably heard before that it's essential to make eye contact while speaking to somebody. Yet you may not realize exactly what major areas of strength, how the force of eye contact in a relationship can be. Assuming that you're looking to fortify your relationship with your partner, learning how to maintain eye contact can help. Eye contact is important, yet certain individuals may have inconveniences maintaining it. Others may not always understand the various kinds of eye contact and could address what eye contact means. Does eye contact mean attraction, always? Or then again can it have different implications? Read on to understand if you're having issues with eye contact, or want to learn more about what eye contact means for relationships. For what reason is it so challenging to make eye contact? The force of eye contact in adoration is undeniable. Yet instigating eye contact is entirely expected. For certain individuals, lack of eye contact can be because of anxiety that arises from modesty or lack of certainty. Now and again, looking individuals in the eye can feel very uncomfortable. In certain instances, individuals may try and have a condition called social anxiety problem which makes them reluctant before others and fear judgment. Studies have shown that this issue makes individuals apprehensive and unable to maintain eye contact. While certain individuals may have this condition, usually lack of eye contact can be tackled with a little increase in trust in many instances. Past anxiety and lack of certainty, trouble with eye contact, may be temporary in certain instances. An individual may be annoyed with their partner, leading them to have inconvenience looking the individual in the eye. Alternatively, they may be temporarily apprehensive about sharing a piece of information with their partner, which can cause them to avert their eye contact until they are willing to examine the relationship issue. Various categories of eye contact. Now and again eye contact can be problematic. However, it is important to perceive that there is more than one sort of eye contact. Before exploring the force of eye contact in relationships further, it is useful to understand the various categories of eye contact. Consider the categories beneath. Intentionally avoiding eye contact. Lack of eye contact, when done intentionally, can be an indication of an issue in the relationship. In such cases, lack of eye contact can be an indication for you to take a hard gander at the relationship and address the festering issue. For example, somebody who avoids looking their partner in the eye may be angry, or they could be hiding something from their partner. Or on the other hand, the lack of eye contact can indicate that they are irritated about something, and you may have to test them to find out the details. Yet, you shouldn't panic that something is frightfully off base on the off chance that your partner appears to stay away from eye contact intentionally, yet you ought to at least be prepared to have a conversation. Unintentionally avoiding eye contact, an unintentional lack of eye contact, can some of the time happen between strangers, or when somebody is apprehensive. It could simply mean a lack of trust in a relationship, or that your partner's mind is somewhere else. Your partner may not realize that they are avoiding eye contact, and assuming they are distracted or bashful, they may not perceive that you're attempting to make eye contact. Accidental glances, certain individuals could ponder, eyes contact always mean attraction. The answer is that now and again, it very well may be accidental and not indicative of an attraction. A person of the other gender could glance your way, accidentally meet your eyes, and then turn away rapidly. One way to let know if the glance was accidental, is that it will probably be a one-time event. Cognizant glances, then again, a glance toward you, wherein an individual immediately turns away when you make eye contact can in some cases mean there was an attraction. The individual may have been gazing at you without your insight, and instead of maintaining eye contact, they turn away, embarrassed, 
when you notice them. The contrast between cognizant and oblivious gazing is that if somebody is deliberately glancing toward you because of an attraction, they are probably going to answer decidedly, for example, with a grin, assuming you make eye contact with them a subsequent time. It is a positive sign. Lingering glances. A reliable indication of eye flirting is those lingering glances that last longer than a couple of moments. At the point when two individuals are attracted to each other, it becomes natural for them to hold eye contact. Lingering glances may happen during a conversation when you notice that you two have locked eyes after smiling at each other or sharing a joke. It could be more inconspicuous than staring at each other. However, the lingering glance is typically meaningful and recommends that you two are connecting. Intense eye contact. Intense eye contact between men and women is more significant and indicates areas of strength for and longing for additional conversation. This eye contact lasts for several seconds or more and indicates that an individual has a genuine interest in you. Individuals in serious relationships may also engage in intense eye contact to show mutual attraction with eye contact and become more like each other. Types of eye contact attraction Similarly, as there are various degrees of eye contact, there are various sorts of eye contact attraction, for example, Eye flirting can communicate a basic degree of attraction and interest. At the point when you love somebody profoundly, you could learn how to maintain eye contact with him to perceive how he answers. If he grins and maintains eye contact with you, there is a decent chance he is attracted to you as well. Holding eye contact with somebody you're in a relationship with or simply getting to know, can also indicate sexual attraction. Finally, the most elevated kind of eye contact attraction is that between two individuals who are infatuated. At the point when your partner or mate meets your eyes and maintains eye contact with you, having their affection toward you is easy. This kind of eye contact shows that they are physically attracted to you and that they care profoundly for you. 10 Powers of Eye Contact in a Relationship Now that we've established the various degrees of eye contact in affection and attraction, now is the right time to continue toward the powers of eye contact in a relationship. Consider the following 10 factors that show the force of eye contact in adoration. 1. Can arouse eye contact from a stranger or somebody who appears angry, can be viewed as threatening or puzzling, yet eye contact from a partner can be a sexual invitation. Giving your partner, the look can place them in the temperament for sex and enhance profound association with them. The force of eye contact major area of strength 4 is the point that research has found that it creates physiological arousal. Thus, not exclusively will you feel in the min sit for the physical association, when your partner makes eye contact, however, you can also anticipate that your body should answer at a biological level. 2. Distinguish ingenuity. The vast majority realize that smiling is indicative of emotional help in a relationship, yet individuals can also fake a grin. Eye contact allows you to determine whether your partner's grin is genuine. At the point when an individual's eyes narrow and create crow's feet around the eyes during a grin, you should rest assured that your partner is genuinely happy and not forcing a grin. A genuine grin reaches the eyes, whereas a fake one engages just the lower half of the face. 3. Leads to engagement. At the point when you make eye contact with your partner, not exclusively will you feel more aroused, yet you'll also feel as on the off chance that they are more engaged in the conversation. Research directed at guinea pigs demonstrates that eye contact establishes more association even between strangers. We as a whole want to feel appreciated in relationships, and making eye contact allows us to feel appreciated. Eye contact increases the association among partners, 
and makes us feel that our partner cares more about us. 4. Read our partners. Your partner may let you know that nothing is off base when disturbed. However, looking into their eyes recounts the genuine story. You can probably tell just from making eye contact when your partner is sad. At the same time, they may appear excited when they are happy. Looking individuals in the eye is an amazing way to stay in line with their feelings, which is vital in relationships, as it allows you to offer help when they appear sad and share in their happiness when their eyes are exuberant. 5. Important for intimacy Intimacy and emotional association are important for a relationship to flourish, and eye contact is one way to achieve this association. At the point when you investigate your partner's eyes, you can begin to feel what they are feeling and share their feelings with them. This draws you two nearer together, allowing for a more grounded association and greater empathy among you. 6. An indication of affection. At the point when you and your partner gaze into each other's eyes affectionately, you too will want to feel the adoration that exists in the relationship. As cliché as it may sound, staring into each other's eyes is a way to communicate your adoration for each other. 7. Become one. Clinicians realize that our brains can interface us with our partners, and even take on their feelings, and propose that the eyes are a window through which we can become one with our partners. A new report found that when an individual's students become dilated, their partners under studies also increase in size. Along these lines, looking into our partner's eyes causes physiological changes that lead us to emulate them. 8. Fabricates trust. Looking into your partner's eyes and holding their gaze while having a conversation assists you with connecting with them. In this manner increasing feelings of trust. It is critical since trust is an important part of healthy relationships. 9. Essential for bonding. To have a fruitful and lasting relationship two individuals should foster a nearby bond with each other. Regular eye contact bonds you to your partner, as the eyes, as the saying goes, are the window to the spirit. Looking into each other's eyes assists you with a feeling associated emotionally and spiritually, creating major areas of strength for a lasting bond. 10. Keeps the attraction alive. Similarly, as eye contact may indicate attraction early in the relationship, it can assist with keeping the attraction alive over the long haul. Locking eyes communicates to your partner that you are attracted to them, which is useful for the relationship. What does lack of eye contact do to a relationship? The importance of eye contact in relationships cannot be denied, and that means that lack of eye contact can damage relationships. For example, on the off chance that you never make eye contact with your partner when they are talking, they may feel disregarded, or if you are not completely paying attention to them. Lack of eye contact can make your partner feel that you don't want them, or are not generally attracted to them. It can make them feel insecure and question their place in your life. Finally, instigating eye contact can weaken the bond and emotional association you have with each other. Lack of eye contact can lead your partner to feel that they cannot confide in you, or as assuming that you are growing apart from them. And, eye contact is important to interface with individuals and fosters the bond that is necessary for a healthy relationship. Assuming you find that you or your partner always avoid eye contact, there may be a lack of association among you or an underlying issue like anxiety. If so, or on the other hand on the off chance that there is by all accounts, a lack of intimacy and association in your relationship, you may profit from seeking counseling to address the issue, some of the time. However, a lack of eye contact can be an issue with certainty or modesty, which you can defeat with practice to encounter the advantages and force of eye contact in a relationship.